Hi, what's up? My name is Adam, and you are on Cyber Raccoon Channel. Today I'm going to tell you about the best survival games. Subscribe our channel, rate this video and you will always be aware of what to play today. Distrust, Polar Survival A helicopter crash left a group of explorers stranded near an Arctic research station. The survivors will have to resist the nightmares of dead frost and hunger. As they try to escape the dangers of the long dark polar night and find a way to the shelter of the abandoned station, all they are doing is sinking deeper into a nightmare scenario. When they fall asleep, they attract a terrifying force that sucks the life out of their bodies, but the longer they battle exhaustion and stay awake, the less likely they are to survive. Guide the explorers through a randomly generated station, overcome the severe climate and fight the unfathomable. This War of Mine in this war of mine you do not play as an elite soldier, rather a group of civilians trying to survive in a besieged city, struggling with lack of food, medicine and constant danger from snipers and hostile scavengers. The game provides an experience of war seen from an entirely new angle. The pace of this war of mine is imposed by the day and night cycle. During the day snipers outside stop you from leaving your refuge, so you need to focus on maintaining your hideout, crafting, trading and taking care of your survivors. At night, take one of your civilians on a mission to scavenge through a set of unique locations for items that will help you stay alive. ARK, Survival Evolved Stranded on the shores of a mysterious island, you must learn to survive. As a man or woman stranded naked, freezing and starving on the shores of a mysterious island called ARK, you must hunt, harvest resources, craft items, grow crops, research technologies, and build shelters to withstand the elements. Use your cunning and resources to kill or tame and breed the leviathan dinosaurs and other primeval creatures roaming the land, and team up with or prey on hundreds of other players to survive, dominate, and escape. Conan Exiles is an online multiplayer survival game, now with mounts and mounted combat, set in the lands of Conan the Barbarian. Enter a vast, open-world sandbox and play together with friends and strangers as you build your own home or even a shared city. Survive freezing cold temperatures, explore loot-filled dungeons, develop your character from a lowly peasant to a mighty barbarian, and fight to dominate your enemies in epic siege wars. Rogue. Have you got what it takes to survive on Mars? Rogue is a multiplayer survival game featuring scientific realism and extremely deep crafting and building. Make the red planet your sandbox and create a thriving colony. Players will have to work together to overcome the many threats they will have to face on planet Mars. Created by team members behind Thief, Half-Life 2, Dishonored, Age of Conan and Assassin's Creed, Rogue is an adaptive survival game that is built on top of Unreal Engine 4 and deeply rooted in science. Players will land on Mars to find that the previously developed human colonies have been decimated and they must work together to overcome and survive. Rook features a persistent world and co-op multiplayer. Hellion is an open-world multiplayer space survival game set in a distant star system amidst the ruins of mankind's first interstellar colony. Fight for survival in a cruel and mysterious world of humanity's ruined hopes. Gather resources, build your outpost, navigate the ship through the vast outer space, find friends to help you and defeat your foes. Explore derelict ships, discover the hidden story and find your way to stay alive. The Long Dark Bright lights flare across the night sky. The wind rages outside the thin walls of your wooden cabin. A wolf howls in the distance. You look at the meager supplies in your pack, and wish for the days before the power mysteriously went out. How much longer will you survive? Welcome to the Long Dark, the innovative exploration survival experience Wired Magazine calls the pinnacle of an entire genre. The forest. As the lone survivor of a passenger jet crash, 
You find yourself in a mysterious forest battling to stay alive against a society of cannibalistic mutants. Build, explore, survive in this terrifying first-person survival horror simulator. Enter a living, breathing world, where every tree and plant can be chopped down. Below ground explore a vast network of caves and underground lakes. The Wild Eight The mysterious plane crash was only the beginning. Eight survivors are stranded in the middle of an unforgiving frozen wilderness of Alaska. Don't let it consume you. Find out the truth. Survive and live to tell the tale of the Wild Eight. In the Wild Eight, always be on the move, it is your only way to survive and find out what happened with this mysterious place. It is a challenging and fun game designed for both teamwork multiplayer and an immersive single-player experience. Rust. The only aim in Rust is to survive. To do this you will need to overcome struggles such as hunger, thirst and cold. Build a fire. Build a shelter. Kill animals for meat. Protect yourself from other players, and kill them for meat. Create alliances with other players and form a town. Do whatever it takes to survive. The Black Death A catastrophic plague has left a trail of destruction across 14th century Europe. Survivors confront sickness and scarce resources in a land rife with banditry. To survive you will need to fight for scarce resources including food and learning new crafting techniques will certainly improve your chances. But in the desperate times, you will need to defend yourself in a land full of bandits looking to profit at your expense and at all times you must avoid the plague. Conditions are harsh, times are dark, this is the land of the Black Death. Green Hell is an open-world survival simulator set in the uncharted unique setting of the Amazonian rainforest. You are left alone in the jungle without any food or equipment, trying to survive and find your way out. Clinging to life, the player is set on a journey of durability as the effects of solitude wear heavy not only on the body but also the mind. How long can you survive against the dangers of the unknown? On this journey, you won't get any help from the outside world. Equipped only with your bare hands you'll have to learn actual survival techniques to build shelters, make tools, and craft weapons in order to hunt and defend yourself. Constantly threatened by the jungle you'll fight with both wild animals and tropical sicknesses. Players will also have to face the traps set by your own mind and fears that crawl in the darkness of the endless jungle. Subnautica is an underwater adventure game set on an alien ocean planet. A massive, open world full of wonder and peril awaits you. You have crash-landed on an alien ocean world, and the only way to go is down. Subnautica's oceans range from sun-drenched shallow coral reefs to treacherous deep-sea trenches, lava fields, and bioluminescent underwater rivers. Manage your oxygen supply as you explore kelp forests, plateaus, reefs, and winding cave systems. The water teems with life, some of it helpful, much of it harmful. After crash landing in your life pod, the clock is ticking to find water, food, and to develop the equipment you need to explore. Collect resources from the ocean around you. Craft diving gear, lights, habitat modules, and submersibles. Venture deeper and further form to find rarer resources, allowing you to craft more advanced items. Fade to silence. As the player you take the role of Ash, a natural but tormented leader. In that role you explore a post-apocalyptic, frozen wasteland to gather the resources necessary to establish a refuge for survival. With dwindling resources, simple tasks like upgrading equipment and collecting materials quickly require an expedition to scavenge the necessary items. In the search for survival materials, you must navigate a vast territory, in which you will encounter eldritch monsters and an even greater foe, the unrelenting winter. While freezing temperatures constantly take their toll on ash, the deadliest event is that of a blizzard. If caught by surprise, it takes every ounce of skill, determination and luck to survive. Stranded Deep Test your survival skills in this open-world adventure. 
In the aftermath of a mysterious plane crash, you are stranded in the vast expanse of the Pacific Ocean. Alone, without any means to call for help, you must do what you can to survive. Build. Craft. Survive. Escape. Explore underwater and on land as you hunt for supplies to craft the tools, weapons, and shelter you'll need to stay alive. Stay sharp, hunger, thirst, and exposure conspire against you as you brave treacherous elements and the dangerous creatures of the Pacific. Live long enough, stay alive. Seven Days to Die Set in a brutally unforgiving post-apocalyptic world overrun by the undead, Seven Days to Die is an open-world game that is a unique combination of first-person shooter, survival horror, tower defense, and role-playing games. It presents combat, crafting, looting, mining, exploration, and character growth, in a way that has seen a rapturous response from fans worldwide. Play the definitive zombie survival sandbox RPG that came first. Knaves Gain Awaits. Astroneer. Explore and reshape distant worlds. Astroneer is set during the 25th century intergalactic age of discovery, where astroneers explore the frontiers of outer space, risking their lives in harsh environments to unearth rare discoveries and unlock the mysteries of the universe. In this space sandbox adventure, players can work together to build custom bases above or below ground, create vehicles to explore a vast solar system, and use terrain to create anything they can imagine. A player's creativity and ingenuity are the key to thriving on exciting planetary adventures. Raft By yourself or with friends, your mission is to survive an epic oceanic adventure across a perilous sea. Gather debris to survive, expand your raft and be wary of the dangers of the ocean. Trapped on a small raft with nothing but a hook made of old plastic, players awake on a vast, blue ocean totally alone and with no land in sight. With a dry throat and an empty stomach, survival will not be easy. Raft throws you and your friends into an epic adventure out on the big open sea, with the objective to stay alive, gather resources and build yourself a floating home worthy of survival. Resources are tough to come by at sea, players will have to make sure to catch whatever debris floats by using their trusty hook and when possible, scavenge the reefs beneath the waves and the islands both. However, thirst and hunger is not the only danger in the ocean. Watch out for the man-eating shark determined to end your voyage. Breath Edge is an ironic outer space survival adventure game. Take on the role of a simple guy called the man who is just carrying his grandpa's ashes to a galactic funeral and suddenly finds himself in the middle of a universal conspiracy. A massive space hearse suffers a wreck in the deep space, leaving the area filled with debris coffins, dead passengers and yourself. Survive in this interstellar dump, uncover a global conspiracy, save the princess and don't break your fingers while tapping the keyboard as you travel around the world, keeping your display on for full immersion is advised. It took a long time for our ancestors to develop because they had no electrical tape. You have it and you know how to use it. With this magical artifact, you can create a vast variety of useless objects and throw them out of the airlock. There are also many useful items to be created, but be careful as this may result in completing the game. RIM World is a story generator. It's designed to co-author tragic, twisted, and triumphant stories about imprisoned pirates, desperate colonists, starvation and survival. It works by controlling the random events that the world throws at you. Every thunderstorm, pirate raid, and traveling salesman is a card dealt into your story by the AI storyteller. There are several storytellers to choose from. Randy Random does crazy stuff, Cassandra Classic goes for rising tension, and Phoebe Chillax likes to relax. Your colonists are not professional settlers, they're crash-landed survivors from a passenger liner destroyed in orbit. You can end up with a nobleman, an accountant, and a housewife. You'll acquire more colonists by capturing them in combat and turning them to your side, buying them from slave traders, or taking in refugees. So your colony will always be a motley crew. Kenshi a free-roaming squad-based RPG focusing on open-ended sandbox gameplay features rather than a linear story. Be a traitor, a thief, a rebel, a warlord, an adventurer, a farmer, a slave, or just food for the cannibals. Research new equipment and craft new gear. Purchase and upgrade your own buildings to use as safe fortified havens when things go bad, or use them to start up a business. 
Aid or oppose the various factions in the world while striving for the strength and wealth necessary to simply survive in the harsh desert. Train your men up from puny victims to master warriors. Carry your wounded squad mates to safety and get them all home alive. Don't Starve Together is the standalone multiplayer expansion of the uncompromising wilderness survival game, Don't Starve. Enter a strange and unexplored world full of strange creatures, dangers, and surprises. Gather resources to craft items and structures that match your survival style. Play your way as you unravel the mysteries of this strange land. Cooperate with your friends in a private game, or take your chances with strangers online. Work with other players to survive the harsh environment, or strike out on your own. Do whatever it takes, but most importantly, don't starve. Miss Survival Subscribe our channel, rate this video and you will always be aware of what to play today.